I'm being thing. forcibly removed from the building again of a public lobby. So. so if you want to take off that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. Sir, please, is there anything I can do, sir, please? Don't do this to my wife, man. You don't know what you're doing to my family, man. Please, I'm begging. I'm literally begging. Where am I going to put my feet? Sir, I'm begging you, please. Please. You want to do it, You let's do it. Let me know, buddy. That is not a crime, and you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Do you know where Lieutenant Mingus is right now? So, no, he's not in the building? I don't know. I'm not. What do you know? Okay, I don't want that man taking my picture. Uh, Why sir, don't you take him out of here? Sir, you hit me. I'm a you hit me. Okay, sir, okay now you take my picture, then. I don't know you. I'm not telling you nothing else until I find out who's driving that vehicle. You not a supervisor, bro. I need somebody higher than you right now. I didn't break the law. I'm not going to be found guilty of anything. This is a waste of time. If you guys want to know who I am, I'll tell you who I am. Okay. You want to know what I'm doing here? I'll tell you what I'm doing here. Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. That's my purse! I don't know you! Spit me on my face right now! She spit in my face! Please, sir, please don't make me sleep in jail. I'm begging you. We're sir, not criminals! Please. They're going to make me sleep in jail. Why? Sir, please. Please, dude, please. Oh, my God, don't do that to him. You guys don't know what you're doing to me, man. Why? Why are you saying right here? Oh, man. You guys really don't know what you're doing to my life with this, man. Seriously, please. We really haven't been getting a lot of support from the community. Um, You know, we need help getting hotels. Uh, we've pretty much got the food and gas covered, but if there's any way anyone can help out in any way, guys, the hotels, uh, the fees have really been killing us. Um, you know, we don't make a, a million dollars. We don't make a whole lot of money. But if there's any way anyone can help out, please, we couldn't do it without you guys. Today's video takes us to New York City with the stop of one of the many post offices located there. Now our good buddy here, Davy Boy, decides he wants to walk in the parking lot behind the post office. Because after all, there's no sign that says no authorized personnel. It says no authorized vehicles. And that's going to be the basis of discontent in this video. How stupid is this guy? Too stupid for me to explain. But not to worry. Sit back, watch, and <laughs> enjoy. They won't let me. I'm gonna go to one zoom out. It doesn't say, it doesn't say authorized personnel on me. Oh, that makes perfect sense to me. It doesn't say authorized personnel only, it says authorized postal vehicles only. And he's certainly not a vehicle, now is he? That makes perfect sense to an imbecile like good guy Otis. Hey, let's carry on. She's talking crazy for my recording. Excuse me, can you get me on post office property, please? Step out. You talking to me, ma'am? Uh, you can't be on the property, sir. You have to go outside the property. Can you show me where it says that at? Where it says no trespassing? Yeah, please show me that. It doesn't say no trespassing? No, it doesn't. Authorized personnel only. Authorized postal vehicles okay. only. I'm sir. not a vehicle, sir. Man. This is the moron behind the camera. His name's David. 
goes by Good Guy Audits on his YouTube channel. I snapped this picture of him from one of his live streams. Uh, he was going to the FBI building. The reason I took this is because his teeth, you have to admit, he looks like a vampire. Man, what is wrong with those two teeth, man? I have never seen teeth like that except in a Hollywood movie. Something wrong with him. Now he wants to argue, I told you, that he's not a vehicle. Let's see how this goes. I'm not a sir. Excuse me, I You're said ma'am. You're not supposed to be on the property, sir. If you it says no here. trespass, authorized, okay. it doesn't say authorized well, personnel only. You, and the gate is wide open. It's wide open for that the means employees it's open. that work here. It doesn't say that, ma'am. You need a sign okay, that I'm says that. I'm telling you that, sir. So please step off the property. Ma'am, you have to have a sign you that says that. You can all you want to. Ma'am. It's a federal property. You're not supposed to be here. Who, who owns the federal government? Who funds the federal you know government? Federal fund. Sir, I need you to be off the property. Why are you recording me while you're at work? Why are you recording me? You're, I'm, a, I'm a private citizen. That's you're at work. No, you're not. Yes, you work for the public. Okay. You're the, Right now, you're in your official capacity. All right, do you need something? Which means you you're not something? supposed to... You can go inside the post office if you need something. Yeah, okay? I want to do a freedom of information request for then that. go inside the post office. Are you the supervisor? Go inside the post office. What's your if name, ma'am? If you have any questions for me, you can meet me outside the post office, inside the window. Okay, who do I ask for? Okay, go to the post office and ask for a supervisor. What's your name, ma'am? Go inside the post office and you can ask for a supervisor. You don't want to identify yourself? When you go inside the post office and ask for a supervisor, someone to meet you at the window. I can hear you, ma'am. You don't have to yell at me. Okay, I don't yell. I just talk loud. That's just me. I understand. That's okay. okay. I thought you was yelling at me. I'm okay, sorry. Okay, but I need you to back off the property because you may get hit by a truck. If no, I'm fine. I, I can take care of myself. Okay. I Look, little Davy boy, you may be able to take care of yourself, but you apparently cannot take care of your wife and your three children. What kind of a man are you? Go out frauditing all day. Get a real job and take care of your family. You're disgusting. I won't buy. If you're they try to, to be in the gate, ma'am, I just showed you that. I, I just showed you the gate is wide open. It's wide open for the employees to drive in. How's it's the an active driveway, ma'am? How's the it's public an active driveway? So you, I, I, I don't cut you off while you talk. Property. That's it. You should put a sign up that says that. Cause how's the public supposed to know? That makes no sense. Moments later. You're telling me to follow the rules. You're not even following your own rules. You know you're not supposed to be recording me while you're at work. You know you're creating a public document that I can request. Because you work for the public. And you're a supervisor. You should, you should be behaving yourself better than that. Especially because I'm recording. Carry yourself with dignity, I guess. I don't fucking know. I don't see what's so bad about me recording, unless you got something to hide. There's no signs here saying that we can't be here. That's it, it just says postal vehicles only. It doesn't say authorized personnel on me. So what do you think, good people? Do you think he's going to venture back into the parking lot? I don't know, because I can't watch these videos beforehand. I know, though, that anytime I see a video from him, it's going to be good. And so I don't preview the video anymore, but I'm betting he goes back in the parking lot. Let's find out right now. This gate is wide open. That means the public can assume it's public access. And they got, they, I guess they ran out of space for the, the vehicles. More moments later. So seven. Hi, can I speak to your supervisor, please? No problem. Thank you. Can, you. can you let her know I'm asking for her? Thank you. Sir, can I get a stamp, please? Just one? Yes, please. Alright, 60 cents. Thank you. 
Do I need a receipt? Thank you so much. The reason these jack wagons buy one stamp and always request a receipt is just in case the police are called then they have proof that they had official business at the post office. But see, it doesn't relieve them from the fact that they've conducted their business and they're still hanging around the lobby filming. Yeah, but they don't think that far ahead. They're not that smart. Is there a survey on there? Yes. Okay, how do I do that? You go, you scan the code, uh -huh. and you go on the website, usps.com. And what was your name? Mr. Davis. Mr. Davis? Okay, I'll give you a good review. Thank you. No, you're welcome. Uh, Hi. Can I help you? Yes. Um, can I get your name, please? Miss Smith. Miss Smith, nice to meet you. I'm David. Um, I want to do a public records request for that video that you made. What video? The video that you was recording outside of me? I didn't make a video. You sure? Cause Are you sure? Yeah, I got it on camera. You got me on camera doing what? Holding Re my phone up? Yeah, recording. Okay. When can you, you turned around. that I was recording? Yeah. No, you can't. When you turned around, you see the red numbers? Okay. That means you was recording. Right. Yeah. Did you delete it? Because you... Okay, I have no recording. Okay. Is there anything else you need for me today? Yeah, how can I do a four-year request? How can I submit one? Um, You could call 1-800-AX-USPS. I could write it out and submit it with you too, right? No. And you forward it to whatever no, department you need to forward it to? No, you USPS, and they'll direct you how you should do it. Okay. I just wanted to tell you, right, that I can. If I write it out and I submit it with you, you have to forward it to whoever you need to forward it to. Okay. But I can submit it with you. Okay. Do you have a piece of paper so no, I can I don't. write it out? No. No. I like this lady. We need more postal employees like her. Look at the look that other employees giving him. Yeah, we need more people like this to stand up to these frauditors and all their nonsense. Oh, yes, indeed. What's so wrong with me recording from the sidewalk? I didn't say anything. Was recording. You was not recording on the sidewalk. I don't have a problem with you on the sidewalk. Yeah, and then I don't I... own the sidewalk. The side post office don't own right. the sidewalk. We own the inside when you came in the gate. What was wrong with that? You were trespassing, sir. You, could no... be a, you are a threat. I'm not to a threat. myself and my employees when you trespass the gate. I'm not a, a threat, okay? ma'am. Yes, you are. You pose a threat when you came across that gate. I understand. Okay? That's so, it. So, I showed you that on that gate, there's no sign okay. that tells the public said that. that we can't be Absolutely. So, how was I supposed that. to know I couldn't be there? I, but I told you. I told you. It's not common sense because the gate I, is I open. I told you. When I told you to this leave the property. This is public property, property, right? I told you to leave the property. You asked Even, me. I asked you to leave the property. You didn't want to. And then I told you to leave the property. Ma'am, but if and it's... And once I did that, then you knew that you were trespassing. I'm not trespassing, You are trespassing when someone asks you to leave the property. Once we ask you to leave, then you are trespassing. Is that a restricted area? Okay. Yes, it is, sir. How? There's no signs. Okay. It doesn't matter if there's no sign or you not. Need sign. It I does matter. Ask, in court? once I ask you... In court, you need I, signs. In court, they'll tell you once you were told to leave the property, then you are trespassing. For private property. This is okay. public property. We're not going to go back and forth. In McDonald's. Anything else if you want to ask me, McDonald's, sir, we're not going to go back and forth. I'm trying forth. to have a cordial conversation. You I keep yelling. I know you're recording my conversation. And you can I'm trying YouTube. to have a cordial conversation. Okay. I doubt if old Davy Boy knows the definition of cordial. Remember... He's a high school dropout. That's why he can't find a job. His arrest record and his lack of education is holding him back. But you know, Davy Boy, there's plenty of programs, especially in New York City, that'll help you get the skills you need to find a good job. You can take care of your family and stop this BS. I am having a cordial conversation. You keep coming off. I don't, I'm okay. not cutting you off. What else you need, sir? So what I'm saying is in court, because this is a public building, how's the public supposed to know that we can't be back there? Okay, when it you doesn't say. Acts, okay. What I'm telling you is for future right, maybe. I don't need future reference from you. Maybe I'll you can tell the, the people, problem. listen, bring us signs so that the public can know they can't be back there. All right. But I told you this, verbally. This is comments and concerns. Okay. Once I told you verbally to leave the property, you was required to leave the property. The area? I told you to leave the property. You were on the postal property when you crossed the gate. I'm on the postal property now. You could be in this side. This is public area. That's not a public area. It is. Because it's wide right. open to the public. We're not going to go back and forth. Anything else you need? Respectfully, it's wide open to the public. Anything else you need? And sir? there's no signs telling the public that they can't be there. Do All you right, understand? you made your point. Anything else okay. you need? I'm just saying so. You made your point. Anything else you need? Ma'am. You made your point. Anything else you yes, need from me? Yes, please. Um, how do I... 
how do I get a, a passport? A passport? You do First passports time I ever know. First time. Can you explain to me the process, please? I'm just trying to let her know. Huh? She's trying to remind you that you're at work and I'm the public and I'm recording. This jack wagon is not at all interested in a passport. I doubt if he could afford the fees to buy one. He just wants this lady to bow down to him and explain to him how to get a passport. Look at him. He doesn't have two dimes to rub together. Look at him. He's pitiful. You're a pitiful excuse for a man, David. Pitiful. Miss, this is Miss Smith. She's the supervisor. You need to bring proof of citizenship. Uh huh. And your birth uh, proof of citizenship and your ID, a state valid state ID. Okay. You could go to one of the clerks. They'll schedule an appointment for you. We okay. take pictures here, or you could get your own picture. Okay. How much does it cost? I'm not sure. You can get online, and one of those clerks could tell you. They process passport. I don't. Okay. All right. So you're the, you're the postmaster here? No, I'm not. Who's the postmaster? So I can write his name. The postmaster is Wanda Diaz. She works downtown. Wanda Diaz. And how does the complaint process work here? You call 1-800-AX-USPS, uh -huh. or you could go to USPS.com. And what is this branch, the name of this branch? Colonial Park Station. Ma'am, respectfully, I wasn't trying to argue with you. I wasn't trying to provoke you. I was just simply recording. That's it. There's, if there was a sign that said I couldn't be back there, I would have never went back there. The gate is wide open. There's no signs that told me that I couldn't be there. That makes it public access. It's public property. That's why I assumed, okay, I could be here. The gate is open. If this is probably I said authorized personnel only, I would have never went back there. You understand? I'm not trying to argue with you. What the hell are you talking about, David? We know that's a lie. It doesn't matter what sign is posted. You're going to challenge it. Yeah, you're just in the uh, health and welfare building the other day and it said no recording and you still record it. So you do what you want. Yeah, you're just a punk trying to pretend like you're a, a big man because you're standing up for American freedoms. If anything, you're eroding our freedoms. Or, or, Is there or else upset you. No, um, so Colonial Park Station. Do you have the address here, please? 99 McCombs Place. Okay. And you're the supervisor? Yes, I am. Thank you so much. Have a good day. God bless you. Ah, alrighty. Well, we got a receipt. Did I grab my receipt? All right. Till next time. And she deleted that public record that she made. Well, there you have it, folks. That's all this fraudster lives for is to go in cause problems and then file complaints on hard-working people. What is your problem, Davy boy? Can't you find a real job? Your mama's real proud of you, isn't she? She got three grandkids that you don't even take care of. What a piece of garbage. At any rate, if you enjoy watching idiots, imbeciles, and morons on my channel, please subscribe. As always, Thanks so much for stopping by. Mm-hmm. Cheers to that. Oh, you assaulted me. I did. So you assaulted me. She assaulted me. Oh. No. Yo, you're racist. Katie. Racist. Oh. oh. Racist Nazi, That's a hate crime. You're being disorderly. Oh, call the police. Morons, call the police. Please. Call the police. I'm not sitting down. I refuse to sit down. I refuse. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. What are you gonna do about it? Nothing. Nothing. You can come try to make me. You're welcome to try to make me. Take a swing. Take a swing. What is the reason for calling the officers here? You go to jail, bro. Go ahead. Put Stop your hands on me. me bro. Put your hands on me. Bro, no I'm reason really, to have. I'm really, I'm really unhappy. This is something you did this to me. I'm gonna arrest you for trespassing yeah, in a minute. On um, public property? Yeah. We're asking you to leave, and you're not leaving. That's trespassing. She's jealous. She's right in my face, guys. You, you just me? assaulted me, man. You can't t come up and touch me like that. You don't have permission to film me in any space. I don't need permission to, yes, to you record do. you in public, man. Actually, no, that's the do. law. Salam yalla hamdula, alu akbar. Hak nuik on the kra! Ula wala fufatai!